welcome to the cruise vlog guys i'm honestly so excited to be here with virgin voyages me and was are literally super tired today we had quite a long day traveling we had to get up quite early barcelona airport was super busy um but we're here now all checked in we sort of got on the ship and just like figured out our bearings you know when you get somewhere new you just want to figure out where you're going where everything is and this ship is absolutely huge we're sailing on the valiant lady and we're doing the irresistible med tour so we're going around like south of france italy and we've got two days in ibiza but i'll share the whole route and everything down below in the description box because each port is like different names but we've just arrived into toulon today so this is the beautiful port with all the boats so we're going to go off and explore that today and yeah and the room we are staying in is the sea terrace cabin so we have our own little hammock just on here which is really cool but it's a really decent sized room i'll pop some clips in there of the room we walked in we have these wristbands too so we use these for check into our room we literally just scan them and then like for food and drink and whatnot when you go to restaurants they literally just scan at this band but this cruise is all inclusive so me and most of our proper foodies and we love all the foods but the room is super nice we have a little tablet and everything we can use the tv um it's just a really nice spacious room the only thing is the bathroom is a little bit on the small side you definitely can't get two people in there but the room is super spacious and the bed was so comfortable last night we had a really good night's sleep here's russ guys he hasn't been on the vlog for ages bonjour we're in, we're in the south of france we're in south of france today so we're literally going to go and explore go and have some breakfast because we've not eaten we literally just had a quick bite to it yesterday when we got here yeah the we first got here was so good yeah we had pizza but was, she was unreal incredible <laughs> yeah. there's just so much food and, and me and russ are going to eat and getting, literally not getting lost i know we've got a good sense of direction but i was walking around like we kept getting lost on the ship yeah, yesterday. Yeah, it's honestly, well, we've been probably, okay, but this is our, mine and Rossi's first ever cruise. We've never done a cruise before, so this is a whole no experience, different experience. Yeah. And we just can't believe how big it is. It's literally just like a massive hotel on the sea. Like we're literally moving. It was going super fast. Did you? I don't know. What, I don't know. I don't know. I just took my breath away a little bit because I've seen everything going on. I was like, how's all this? Like, yeah, I think water. it's definitely. Like, how's it? Like, how's this many people? Kind of things. Yeah, so it's yeah, and it's definitely like a pinch me moment. Like for me and for us, but to do something like this with Virgin like we've never i've never done anything like this before so we feel super grateful um like to be here and spending the week with virgin so yeah we've got our outfits for the day which has got his little linen shirt on i'm wearing a little bandeau top and my linen trousers and i've put lots of sun cream on and yeah we're gonna go and grab some breakfast and then go and explore toulon It's very very warm. It's a cute yeah. little like square and that isn't it? Yeah, um, we're just walking dive. along. Yeah, it's really really humid So we're just walking along the water. You can literally just see the boat and literally can't believe how big it is Yeah, it's ridiculous. You just like look at all the other boats and it's like, Yeah, okay, the harbour's wow. like so pretty. The water's really calm as well. So we've just come back to the room for a bit. I've just done some editing. I've been doing like little mini vlogs for TikTok, so make sure you follow me over there. But this is our right. We're gonna go and chill now. We're gonna go to Richard's rooftop because that's our VIP. There's happy hour at five for an hour and we get literally Moe on tap, which is amazing. So we met the most of it. Yeah. The guys were in there yesterday sitting in the hot tub. We've met some lovely people already. I've met Georgia as well, who I know before. She's already an influencer, so we've been with her and Leon. She's getting on like a house on fire with Leon. They're, they're literally, yeah, they are bad really influence. Nice, um, two guys yeah. kind of 
One's from New, they're from New York, aren't they? Matt's from New York. Yeah. Rich is from LA, but they're, they're, they're dead same kind you of thing. Just being, meet so many nice people. Drinks, and then he's like, "Have a gin and tonic." Come on, double. It was like you two are naughty, like that Literally. to me. Literally. Like, so funny. yeah, we're just having like a really nice time meeting new people. So yeah, I've done all my editing and bits now. I'm gonna go enjoy the rooftop and have some champagne. go for dinner and I'm wearing this beautiful H&M stripy dress but how beautiful is the sunset? Like absolutely so I'm just some nice pictures. Just gonna add, we're completely sober. Yes we're sober. Versus this one one member of the band is drunk. One the man is dead. Has, yeah he's, he's man down. He's left the group. We're not down. He's left the group. <laughs> yeah. I think he's I asleep. Have, I went to casino. <laughs> Unfortunately Leon didn't make it back from the casino. <laughs> yeah. I don't know where he is now. But we're all here anyway. We've got reservations. We're here. We've got lots of pictures. We've got pictures. We did have reservations, you're yes. so right. We've, we've had, had a little threesome, not in that way, <laughs> with the sunset. But we're, we're, we're all good. Content. He's literally so drunk. But yeah, Mexican in a minute when we find the drunk. other. I'm about a fifth of the way there. Yeah, literally margarita. I got margarita because I thought it's really nice. Of it is nice, isn't it? It is quite nice, yeah. Quite nice, yeah. We need to catch up now. Put the beer right in top of there and just drink. You'll see it. Yeah. Beer straight into there. Yeah, just yeah, put the beer straight, straight on top. It's called a michelada. They don't make it here. It's a special request. Natalia. Natalia, she doesn't know what a michelada is. <laughs> you know what a michelada is? Michelada? Michelada. You don't know what a michelada is. Oh, michelada is, is the one with Frank? No. See? <laughs> It's a real Mexican drink, so you drink that and tell me what you think. Let's have you got one, man. Yeah. Joe, have you got one? I, I just finished two, actually. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to have another one. You guys enjoy. Right, go Thank on you. then. Thank you. Right, go on then, you oh, two. Shit. Cheers. Let's put your drinks in. Cheers. They don't need it. They're, they're, no, they're good. They're okay. They're fine. It, it looks like something. It looks like tomato oh, okay. juice. Yeah. 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 That's if you like spice, so it should be fun. <laughs> <laughs> Spice for us. Is it really spicy? Oh, yeah, I was gonna ask that. <laughs> is it? It's got a kick. Is it? That's got a kick. Oh, Christ, that's got a kick. Really? There's no toilet on that floor of the Florence tomorrow. There's no what? Toilet. Georgia and Leon are on that coach of us tomorrow. We'll make sure of that. That's your arse. All for the blog. You just sit like, I can't get both of you in. Oh my god, what, what a shit show this is. Three. Five. 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 I like the way you film that, Liam. Come on. You guys have got to lean in and grab the drink. Yeah. Oh, lean in. Lean in and laugh. Oh, no. Guys. We need to get drinks first. She's going to taste the champagne bar. Easy come, easy go. Little high, little low. Hear me where the wind blows. Hello, sir. Hello. <laughs> I feel like I'm missing something in my life. Really? Really? Excuse me. 
We can get more. No, 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 no. I was, it was just an observation. Simple observation. So we are in Florence, yeah. we're just walking, following the tour guide, it's very hot, it's a yeah. crazy heat wave yeah. Yeah. in Italy and it's only half ten and it is boiling, I can she feel the sun, I've gone for like a strapless dress today, um, Ross is feeling very fragile this morning, yes. because, on school now, kids. yes, we, I was nice and fresh this morning, Russ, yeah, I think he just needs hair of the dog and a pizza and some carbs, yeah? Pizza and carbs. Pizza and carbs. Pizza is carbs. <laughs> Pizza is carbs. Mm -hmm. Getting married at 30 is still beautiful. Starting a family after 35 years is still possible. And buying your first house after 40 is still a boss-ass move. Don't let people rush you with their timelines. Just move as you Just move as you Pretty good on you Taking a year to go and travel the world Could be when you're 42 Still in love with your soul At 80 Drinking your coffee and going on dates There's no rushing No time Good evening. So we've all freshened up now after a really lovely day in Florence. Hot day. It was very, very hot. hot, so hot. So yeah, we've sort of like freshened up now. We've got an, a restaurant booked. Ex it's extra virgin. Extra virgin, which is the Italians. So we thought we'd do a whole Italian, Italian day. day. We're in Italy. Because we're in Italy. So first time in Italy, and yeah, we absolutely loved it. So here's a little look at Ross's outfit. Where's your shirt from? H and M shirt. It's in, the nice that one. One. in the sale now. In the sale. H&M in these really short I had the dark colour last year and um, so I bought the light ones and I put my re shoes on. Re shoes. Yeah, you can just see here. We'll do a little outfit check in a sec. And I'm wearing this mango crochet shirt and I've just paired it with some cream shorts, my little crochet bag, and some rat shoes. It's just super simple, and really easy. I feel like. It's going to take it off, there. yeah. It's respect to leave port. It's going to leave way, now. The day at sea. Yeah, we've got a full day at sea tomorrow, but what I like about this cruise is that, like, some people do get really dressed up, but it's actually quite nice and casual as well. Like, I have brought heels with me, but I think I'll wear heels for, like, when we've got the staircase, the way it's really posh. We're just sort of trying to suss out the sort of different themes of the restaurants. And last night we went to the Mexican, which was so nice. It was called, is it pink? Pink agave, it was called. But it was honestly, Russ had, we both had a steak. Incredible. Amazing and the corn they did this like spicy corn and we had loads it of it was It was really literally nice so fair, yeah. so nice. Yeah, we really enjoyed that last night So definitely recommend doing the Mexicans. Yeah, we're gonna go to the back of the ship now and head to our dinner reservation later
So we've had a day at sea today. The lens might look a little bit steamy because I've just walked out and it's like, it's really humid, isn't it? Yeah. It's actually like super humid. So we've had a day at sea today. We literally just got ready for dinner. This is wearing all linen. Linen shirt. Linen shirt. Linen trousers and Hermes dupes. Yeah, it's Hermes June. dupes from June. Then I'm wearing this h and dress. The lens is steamy. <laughs> The humidity, isn't it? it's it's literally Sorry, so yeah, humid. Yeah. So apologies for the humidity because it's gone. I think I need to try and clean it again. And I think the camera's not as steamy. We've yeah. had a cocktail. This is the golden horizon. Horizon tequila. It's very this good. Is Heineken. Heineken. This part of the ship is really nice. It's like we've come here for like what was the food like tapas tikka, wasn't it? Yeah, tapas tikka was like a little knock. It was like a side of steak. It was like in little pieces. It was I like had prawns. Like, yeah, from and the ship really vibe nice. was really nice as well. Yeah, so yeah. but you can nice see the vibes. We're like in a hotel yeah. in a place, so you can get that vibe. Like, yeah, like every part is different. But you can see how literally this Sorry, is the guys, I'm literally <laughs> taking in the sun. Uh, yeah, the nice. sunset is literally just behind us. I don't know if you can just see on the camera. It's gonna look. <laughs> We've just done some outfit pictures and we're going to head for to Gun Bay tonight. Yeah, and we need to head off. We need to head off because we're late. Like, we're late. We've got people there anyway. Literally. And, uh, Behind the scenes, <laughs> we're going for dinner with George and Liam. And yeah, we've only had some tap and yaki tonight. So. It's a tap and yaki. It's not a tap and It's a tap and yaki. Korean barbecue. Same. They do drinking games with it as well. They do drinking games. So I'm sure we'll get very drunk tomorrow yeah. and we'll be hungover. We, went to, we had a boat day today and last night, the night before we could have drank and we didn't drink. And we're all in the mood to drink tonight. Before, yeah. yeah. So we'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll, we'll, be fine. we'll pair through. Yeah. But yeah, have these and we'll go for dinner. <laughs> Camera there. <laughs> We've got the one and only. Oh, Matt. Yeah. Welcome. Welcome to the vibe. We met them. When did we meet you guys? First day. Yeah. yeah. Really first day. Yeah. yeah. What's the first day? It was actually early. Early doors. No, it wasn't. Yeah. It was Mo Moe Monday. It was. It was. Yeah. No, 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 no. We told him that he won't listen. Welcome to Jumanji. Welcome to Jumanji. That's what I thought you were going to say. I'm a treasure. Oh shit. Shit. 369. Sam Yuku. Oh boy. This is going to be bad. This one is called Bancham in Korean. This one is a welcome platter. Thank you. Okay, so in this Bancham, we have the green one, this is watercress salad. And then we have kimchi or fermented cabbage over here. We have bean sprout, this one. And this is potato salad and eggplant. Oh. So good for the vegetarians. Huh? Yeah, I know, <laughs> I know. And this is their dinner. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you can start having this while I prepare my system. All right, so these are chicken nuggets. Oh, you like them, oh. don't you, Leon? Chicken nuggets. I knew it, I knew it. I knew it. You're literally like... See, that's the kids. Yeah. Chicken nuggets. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy your seaweed. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> Thank you. Is everyone paid to that? Yeah, I know. <laughs> 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 
Oh, he's still joking. <laughs> I know. But if you check a bit of this, it will be very spectacular. Yes. So these are conducts, seafood conducts. We have squid, octopus, and shrimp. It's blended together and then we shave it in the corner. So you can just pick one and pass around. But it's a bit spicy. So is everyone okay with spices? Yeah. yeah. Alright, so just spice it up. Yeah, why not? Yeah. To remind ourselves. This is delightful. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it? That is so good. I don't know what, what, what is that? It's, it's like a milkshake. Yeah, it's, it's, it's so good. But I don't know. You're supposed to say the forbidden number, you just clap, and it goes to the next person. Can so you like, say what? the same number twice or no? No, it's, it goes like uh, one, two. So like, say they say two, you can't go, you can't say two. No, you can't say two. Two, 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 four, six, eight. Or you just clap. So instead of saying the number, you just clap. Ah, okay, okay. It goes to the next person. I'm scared! <laughs> It's really I'm simple. So I'm gonna be so drunk. <laughs> so it will go like this. One, just give me two, a shot claps, three. What else okay. oh! So, That's how you don't play. Do you want us to do a practice round first? Yeah. 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 We have a Alright, so for the practice round, we're going to start from one. One, two. <laughs> Four. So it was three, and then you say four, four and then five. 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 He claps. Seven, eight. He claps. Ten, twelve. All right. So If you say top, you can't say. Uh, yeah. You can't. 13, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, if you're ready, give me a gambe! 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 Ten! Eleven! Twelve! Fourteen! Seventeen! Eighteen! Twenty! Twenty-two! Twenty-four! Twenty-five! Twenty-seven! Twenty-eight! Thirty! Oh! If I could tell you, I don't think you'd believe. So we are in Corsica today. It's very, very hot. I've literally really, really hot. warm. <laughs> but also I've just done some cute epic pictures, but it's really cute. It's just, yeah, I feel like we just need to find somewhere we can sit, strip off. I want to find a beach. <laughs> yeah, me and Leon are just going to go straight into the sea and dive straight in. Skinny dip in. <laughs> we are, straight in. You're just going straight in. Take on your fear. Take say, on your I fear. I can say that to you about drinking beer last night. <laughs> <laughs> we found out Russ can't drink by the yeah, way, guys. Yeah, literally. Russ. He went back. full hard he, there. Oh, yeah, I'm a drinker. I'm a drinker. Oh, I can drink. I didn't say last that. Night. I never said last that. Last night, night he squirmed up. Oh, I, I, I did it. I did it. I'm Come tired. On, please. I'm going to shit myself. I was going to put myself. this way. I'm begging you to stay And if I could show you I'd hope that you could see All the possibilities There could be a place for you and me And under the stars You pack up your car Cause you're going far away from here 
so we've just been to the beach. It's so bonjour. nice. Bonjour. We're in. Oh yeah. <laughs> bonjour. I was thinking where we was then. Bonjour. Uh, but yeah, yeah, it was really nice to cool off in the sea. Jimmy Powell Russell. Chevita or Unstilo. I don't even know what he's saying. I don't know what he's saying, but yeah, it's been so warm today. So it's been nice too. Sorry, it's really low. Just go and chill by the sea, get in the water. It was so cold, really clear. Yeah, it was super refreshing, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, we're gonna pop down and have a little look into the little town bit. Yeah, now. we're gonna mooch down there, then we're gonna get back on the boat then for some lunch. So we are back in the room, we've came up and got showers and everything I'm literally just chilling in my pajamas but I thought I'd pick up the camera because I've had a few people ask me on Instagram like whether you feel the ship like moving and rocking and to be honest I've not really felt it that much I did when I first got on the ship and I'd feel it in the bathroom but we're going along now and we can actually Russ is like oh my god Russ say hello <laughs> hello it literally like feels like it's yeah, like it's, uh... Yeah, it's, I'm sort of just sitting like this fine. editing stuff. It's been fine the whole time till... Excuse the mess of the room, guys. Yeah, till just... It's literally like just... Gone. You can see the hammock, like, swinging. The hammock swinging, but you can see the coat The worst them, is it. the hangers. But so if you sit to the try and focus on something, honestly, you can feel my, my, my stomach goes... I think you just need to... Yeah, I've just sort of been sitting here editing and not... Like, it doesn't really bother me, but I only really noticed... I was like, oh, Russ, did you feel that? Did you feel that? And then we looked at the hangers in the in the wardrobe, and they're going like this. So yeah, you do. It's not even. Does it even look that choppy? It's not that bad. Yeah, I think it's Actually, windy. We don't, we don't feel. I've never felt it at all. The only time I feel it is if we're in the toilet or the shower. It's yeah, really when you. Yeah, that's the only time you feel just it. It's weird. I don't know if it's a summit. I don't know if it's there. The rooms have got. I think because it's a smaller summit. I do, but I don't know if it's summit in the rooms because it's all the pipes. Yeah. I'm, I don't know. I don't know, it's, but it's we're sitting here. Yeah, I don't know, but like, now it's like, yeah. yeah. Oh, so I'm lying here. Thank God, me. yeah, we only, had one, we only had one glass of champagne at happy hour because the five till six, we love doing it, but the last we've been doing it hard every night and every time we've been getting ready, like we've been like tipsy and it's made us sleepy, so we thought we'd come back up now and thank God we didn't have the happy hour because the ship is literally rocking like this. So yeah, we thought so. we'd... Come back for a little chill. It's actually Scarlet Night tonight, so I'll show you guys what I'm getting, um, or what I'm wearing because I'm, I've brought that red dress with me. You're gonna see my pack with me, so I'm gonna wear my red dress tonight. The whole ship is dressing up. They've got like a party on the top around the pool. What time did it start? Is it like quarter eleven? I suppose it is nine. I think nine for some nine. of these pictures and stuff. I think it starts at quarter to eleven. The main like dis disco, disco, yeah, disco yeah. Kick. We've been no, in the manor quite a bit as well, yeah. which is the disco part. We've been in there last it's like night. Disco, so. It's like a little mini nightclub. Mini it's nightclub, quite good yeah. To if you want to go off to do something next, but yeah, we've been actually going to bed really late as well. We've been in the casino. We've been in the disco. We definitely, do we get back to three a.m. this morning, and then we have yeah, to try get up early. This one, not too early, but yeah. it was so hot. Like walking around Corsica, like, it was beautiful. The sea was so nice, but it oh, was, yeah, it was so just hot warm. today. It's not a few of us about. Not in a bad way. I think it's just, just not used to it. Yeah, and because we've been drinking the champagne, and drinking, we've not been drinking enough water, so. Yeah, we need to always have a little ones. bit, yeah. Be smart, keep, keep hydrated. <laughs> Behave, but yeah, I'll show you guys my outfit and everything when I'm all ready. So, Russ is all ready for Scarlet Night. He's got a dark burgundy shirt on. Got a bonnet shirt on. really red, red, except for stuff was like... Yeah, like really bright, literally yeah, that, that red. red. But at least you can wear that again. He's just styled yeah. it with some black shorts. Some black, and yeah, some shorts and my... Hermes Duke, Duke sandals. sandals. Are they from June? June, June yeah. June. Of course, we said they're doing a like a tan style colour and leather, but... Wasn't going to get inside. No, no, so yeah. And then if I did the camera around. Yeah. This is the HM dress that you guys love so much. I did, I was going to put the other one on, but it's like too fitted and I've drank and eaten so much. So this feels nice and comfortable, but I like the back. I've got a little bit of a tan. Flat shoes. This chocolate has been quite casual, hasn't it? Yeah. So I have brought heels with me, but I do feel. I love my flat shoes, but these go with everything. So yeah, we're gonna go up to top deck now and go and have some dinner. Deck 15. Going down. <laughs> the amount of times, guys, we've got lost on this ship. Like, constantly getting lost. <laughs> I wish I could show, but I never call. And you're going all the way this year mm -hmm. If I could tell you I don't think you'd believe How long I felt this way Pass. 
feel a hundred degrees when you call my name, and I don't know what you see. Hope we feel the same. I feel a hundred degrees when you call my name, and I don't know what you see. which has been in a little bit seasick. The sea's obviously recent, it was proper, but he's feeling a bit funny at doing so get some tablets. He's not even had a pudding. So that's when you know Russ isn't feeling very well. Yeah, but he's really rough. The top, this is kind of yeah, so I think it's because we're at the bottom, but like you can see there, and I think you can really feel the vibrations of the ship for the floor. Which I think it's a vibration on the chair. We'll get you some tablets. Oh, the safe tonight is in. Yeah, it's fine. I'll have some tablets. Good evening. So we've had a day on the boat today. We went to the spa for a really nice, really nice and chilled in there, wasn't it? Yeah, we've just I did been have 15 minutes in the sauna and then went straight into the plunge pool. It was actually quite you nice. You had a proper like, needed, plunge yeah. pool in there. So we went to the spa. I did a little bit of work. We've literally just been chilling on the boat because we have just arrived in Ibiza. So Ibiza. we're all dressed up ready for dinner so we're gonna go for dinner off the ship Rook, russ's book what's it called zuma. again zuma. Going to zuma no zuma 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 Z -U -M -A. zuma so it overlooks ibiza old, old town. town it's been nice at the night time seeing all the lights across the castle and stuff the old yeah town yeah so we've bought that for dinner so that's the only night we're spending off the ship so i'm just wearing a all white dress just from h&m russ has got a new mango shirt that so he picked up in corsica. corsica and then i got my linen the linen trousers because we might be popping out after two it's called lee potentially leo's. going to leo's so we're going to see off the ship but they need to wear i was going to wear this nice linen shorts but they said they need to wear smart trousers yeah so he so wasn't was sure like, what to mm, put on so we're just going to go with the flat well, russ is very burnt he's not been putting his cream on i've literally just looked a little bit bronzed I you haven't been putting cream on. Cream on. I have. That's why his face looks like a lobster. So yeah, we're all dressed up, ready. Gonna get some nice sunset pictures of the back of the ship and then go into Ibiza. Ibiza. <laughs>
get ready with me like on the ship this has literally been so busy we've literally been so busy on this trip and we've had the best time so we've been in Ibiza today we was at in Ibiza last night so the ship stayed over and yeah we had literally such a good time we didn't go to bed till about half four in the morning so yeah we're very tired today we wandered around Ibiza old town it was a bit cloudy in that in the morning um, and it brightened up and whatnot we moved around the shops and we were just yeah, we were super tired, so we sort of come up onto the boat, had some lunch, enjoyed the last happy hour. So, yeah, it's been literally such a busy few days. And then tonight we're going to dinner at the Pink Agar, which is the Mexican, which has been our favourite restaurant on the ship. The food has been absolutely incredible. Like, me and Russ are such foodies. We love our food so much. So I've got my makeup bag down here. Um, yeah the food has been amazing we spoke to other people that have been on other cruise ships like royal caribbean um celebrity cruise and they said that the food on this ship has been literally the best food they've ever had on a cruise so we've literally eaten so much and there's so much variety so much choice um we've been, we, there's a little like pizza place where we get pizza for lunch and like loads of the richard rooftop has like a little snack menu it's just been yeah if you're a foodie like me and russ then yeah you'd get spoiled for choice on the cruise but yeah we're just getting ready now we're currently leaving ibiza the ship feels a little bit rocky but not as bad as the other night we've got some tablets um one tablet less for russ to take so hopefully he feels okay so we're going to take that in the next half an hour or so but a few people i think when i spoke on the blog before when russ wasn't very well um a lot of people we went down for dinner russ really struggled at the wake like it was i think it's because it was at the bottom the steak was amazing the food was amazing but because it was at the bottom right by i think it was the windows and if the lower down you are on the ship the worse you can feel it so they say to stay on mid ship we also did the scarlet night party on top of the deck and everyone was dancing around the pool and you were sort of like dancing and really feeling the ship move so we sort of like oh god we want to come down like it does feel like really it was really really windy um but so far hopefully on the move back to barcelona now i think that's why it was going so rocky the other night because it was going so fast so fingers crossed it's not as bad tonight but yeah i think if you are planning on coming on a cruise then just take some tablets just in case for like motion and nausea because Russ never thought that he would get it wasn't the sickness it was just the nausea it was giving him a headache he had a really like, really funny head so yeah if you are traveling on a cruise anytime soon you've not done one before then I would just pack some just in case because you never know but yeah we've literally had the best time on this trip we've met the most amazing people like you know when you meet people when you go on holiday and it really makes your trip like we've had the best time like i literally can't explain how much me and russ have joined at this enjoyed this cruise it's just been amazing so yeah i'm gonna get ready for dinner i've just been literally wearing like my skin has broke out so i had the hydrofacial before this trip and i've got some spots that i've really i think it's because i've been shooting content i've been putting makeup on and i've been putting my spf on and then my pores are getting clogged after I just had them, everything sucks out of them. So my skin has a lot of a spot here, has broke out a little bit. So I've got my little emergency pseudo cream with me. Um, I'm just wearing, of course, my go-to, my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. I've got my Beautiful Skin and Foundation. I've gone pretty much makeup free the last couple of days. So I've not been putting any makeup on in the day. I've just been wearing my, I love this SPF on this trip. It's the Beauty Pie Featherlight UV SPF 50 and it's a primer as well. So it's been a really, really nice um, primer for my makeup. But I've also been using the La Roche. And also I did mention on my pack with me about the sun cream situation about things getting stained. So I bought the Cordially one and I've had like really mixed reviews, but it actually like stained my clothes quite bad. Um, Sorry, I literally, I literally thought it was a dolphin. We've, we've seen dolphins the other day. Um, I can't remember if I mentioned that I was literally so desperate to see dolphins and we were eating breakfast the other day 
Um, I managed to get like a little video on my phone, but they were too far away. Um, I mean, been Sin Dolphin, so yeah, super chuffed. Um, but yeah, with the sun cream, the cordially one stained. The one that we've been loving, which has been a lot better, is the sun one one. So we bought, I bought a thirty. So I'm trying to find all my makeup brushes are literally all on the floor down here. Um, we bought the sun bun one, but I got the Factor 50 in the spray, which has been so good just for like quickly spraying on because I found the cordially one, Factor 50, it's, it's a really lovely sun cream, it's really nourishing, but it is quite thick and you have to really rub it in and like it's signed on the sim shorts, it's signed on my white linen shirts, so I've got so much sound maybe washing to do when I get home because of that cream, but the Sunburn one has been amazing. We've not opened the Factor 30 because we've literally just been using the Factor 50 spray and it's just been perfect for walking around. You know, when you go away and you just like roaming around, you can actually lightly spray and it doesn't feel like you've got cream on. So I definitely, definitely recommend the Sunburn. It hasn't stained anything either at all. Like I've been lathering it on. I've been wearing like my whites, my little shirts, a lot of light colors and it's been absolutely fine. Before I literally power through getting ready, I thought I would show you these. So I brought these with me, which are really nice for holiday. They are the Beauty Pie Super Cheek um, like cream blusher. So this one is the colour. It's more like, I'd say it's like a corally colour. So it's called Fresh Face, and then this one is called Bare Blush, but they're a really lovely cream blush. Like I've been putting this on, every single night it just looks just so nice you know when you want that nice holiday dewy look it looks really nice as well this one does with red lippy so i'm going to power through now i need to dry my hair i'm hoping that it dries out a little bit um being out here doing my makeup but yeah looking forward to dinner and with everyone that we've met on this trip and yeah i'll show you guys my outfit when i'm all ready from far away she looks so good Grew up in the same neighborhood And that's how to rub salt in the wound Spend a few hours on the reservoir Never broke a bone, so I'm gonna try hard To prove you wrong That I'm not who I used 